The first thing to reduce health impacts of, of climate change is to stop climate change. In 20 years time I would hope to be out of a job because I would hope that we do not need to be thinking about climate change. If we're still talking about preventing climate change at that time we're at, we're at a serious problem. It's really important that we develop resilient health systems and with research we can understand the best ways to do that. It's only by understanding these climate change impacts on health that we can start to help policymakers, practitioners, planners, uh, operators of health systems make critical decisions about where do they put their resources both in terms of people but in terms of money. I guess as a researcher my hope would be that my research and the university's research in climate change and health answers questions that are useful for government agencies and organisations like the World Health Organisation to deliver an impact in the real world. So I think in the short term it's about making sure our, our health colleagues get engaged with climate change and the people who work on climate change science and on climate impacts come together to really form good teams to tackle long-standing problems. At Bristol we're working together to find solutions to these complex problems so that we can all have a healthier future.